Let friends in your social network know what you are reading about Sorry, Grays, fans. Jesse Williams, who plays Dr. Jackson Avery, is leaving the ABC medical drama. See his message to fans. A link has been sent to your friend's email address. A link has been posted to your Facebook feed. Grey's Anatomy star Jesse Williams and real estate broker Aaron Drake Lee called it quits on their marriage after nearly five years. It's time to say farewell to another departing doctor, Jesse Williams is exiting ABC's Grey's Anatomy after 12 seasons. Williams, who played Dr. Jackson Avery, first joined the medical drama in 2009 as one of the doctors who joined Mercy West Medical Center after the merger. He will appear in his final episode titled, Tradition, on May 20. As an actor, director and person, I have been obscenely lucky to learn so much from so many and I thank our beautiful fans, who breathe so much energy and appreciation into our shared worlds, continued Williams. Jesse Williams played Dr. Jackson Avery since season 6. Photo, Jason LaVeries, film magic, the experience and endurance born of creating nearly 300 hours of leading global television is a gift or carry always. I am immensely proud of our work, our impact and to be moving forward with so many tools, opportunities, allies and dear friends. Vernoff called Williams, an extraordinary artist and activist. Watching his evolution these past 11 years both on screen and off has been a true gift, she said in the statement. We will miss Jesse terribly and we will miss Jackson Avery, played to perfection for so many years. His exit isn't the only surprise for Grey's fans. In this week's episode, Williams' character paid a visit to his former love interest, Dr. April Kepner, played by Sarah Drew who departed the show at the end of season 14. TV, Grey's Anatomy, is, not responsible for politicizing COVID, Ellen Pompeo says of new pandemic season, Grey's Anatomy, returned to ABC on November 12 for its 17th season and largely centers around the coronavirus pandemic. I think it's our job to humanize it, Vernoff said during Variety's Virtual Power of Women panel in October 2020. I feel like the politicians have politicized an illness that affects human beings regardless of political affiliation. So our job is to make it human, not political. Contributing, Elise Briscoe, David Oliver Copyright 2021 USA Today, a division of Gannett Satellite Information Network, LLC.